Good morning, East Texas. I'm Darn Rhodes, and this is the TylerPaper.com morning news update. North Korea's leader isn't pleased with the latest film from funny men Seth Rogen and James Franco, in which the pair play assassins pretending to be TV newscasters in order to kill the North Korean president. A Kim Jong-un spokesman called it an act of war. The government of North Korea is not pleased with Seth Rogen's upcoming film, The Interview, calling it a wanton act of terror. The movie, slated for release later this year, stars Seth Rogen and James Franco, who attempt to assassinate the North Korean leader Kim Jong-un after landing an interview with him. The North Korean government has promised a merciless retaliation against the United States if the interview is released, calling the film an act of war. In a statement published by the state-run KCNA news agency, a spokesman said the film is the work of a gangster movie makers and is a wanton act of terror. An unofficial spokesman for Kim Jong-un said in an interview with The Telegraph that the film mirrors what the U.S. has done in Afghanistan, Iraq, Syria, and Ukraine. Rogan wrote on Twitter that he hopes Kim Jong-un likes the movie. This morning's featured focus in on I mean, photo gallery was taken by our James Bauer at the Smith County Law Enforcement Recognition Luncheon. All the photos are available for purchase. Visit focusin.me by clicking the photo link at the top of any TylerPaper.com page. Thanks for watching and look for more news updates throughout the day.